Help! If she tries to leave, kill her. You must be pretty strong to make it here. A bunch of raiders flinging fire? Not even a challenge. Most of them were never going to be worth forging in the first place. See, Jake? Here's someone who might actually be worth my time. Unlike you. But, You're gonna kill me. But I brought everything you asked for. Stealing things from your family farm doesn't prove your strength, boy. Though this wonderful sword you brought does put me in the mood to give you one last chance to prove your worth. What do you say? Kill that prisoner and prove that you aren't completely useless. You said we'd be raiding outside the Commonwealth. These people aren't even a threat to us. Prove to me that you can kill! It's him or you. Oh god, what do I do? What do I do? Walk away, Jake. Please, let me go! You don't have to What's do this. Gonna be, Jake? If I don't, they'll kill me. What about Prove your family? To me that you're worth Is this forging? what Abraham would want you to do? I thought he hated me. Did, did he send you here to find me? Yes. He's stubborn. But I think he wanted me to bring you back. You're right. I don't want to join the forge. I just want to go home. Last chance, Jake. If you don't kill the prisoner These criminals before I get to the heavily brain. armored. Caution. Uh, that's not... <laughs> Sorry, I, I messed up. I panicked. What were you doing with those guys anyway? Uh, yeah. Uh, well, just... I thought we'd be raiding outside of the Commonwealth. And that I if I joined them, I could provide for my family. I don't know. God, my dad's right. I'm such an idiot. Look, I, I should probably try to go home and make amends. I know I've got no right to ask, but I bet if you're there to explain... Things with my dad would go easier. I bet if you bring my great-granddad's sword, he'll make it worth your while. He always tries to deal fair with people. I'll wait for you by the overpass near the farm. Thanks a lot. I thought I was gonna die back. giving me a present? Keep them from raiding our farm. I didn't. I don't want to hurt anybody. I don't care what you thought. I told you. Abraham Francis Finch, that's enough. Mama, it. Shut up, Jake. 
If I hear anything out of either of you, you'll both be peeling potatoes for the next year. I have watched you two go at it for years and tried to let you sort it out for yourselves. Abraham, your son is a grown man. And if you expect him to act like one, then you'd better stop treating him like a child. Jake, your father and I have been out there, and we know it can be dangerous. We just want to make sure you're prepared. There, it's over. And if I hear another word about it from either of you, so help me. She's right. Abraham. She's right. I've been a fool. There's no way I can thank you enough. Here's something for your help. I think you should hang on to that sword. It'll put a smile on Granddad's face to know it was being used to help you. Thanks again for getting me out of there. 